Hey guys, Chris again from ClassicVWBugs.com and in this tip I want to talk to you about how to remove old undercoating. As you can see, we're doing a body off restoration here on a Beetle and this chassis had a lot of undercoating on it that many people spray. You can get this spray from any auto parts store, but you know we wanted to get rid of the undercoating and make the pans look nice and black and jet black and make them look real show worthy. So we've been chipping away and getting all the undercoating off on this uh, chassis and the way we usually do it is with a gas acetylene tank uh, with a torch end on it uh, that you can pick up from any gas supplier uh, and uh, you, what usually the process is, is you get it you bring in your empty tank and they give you a new one uh, basically we torch up and heat up the undercoating so it gets nice and soft and then we just basically scrape it off so once it gets nice and soft like mud um, you will need good ventilation with this this does start to stink when you do uh, scrape this stuff off so be sure you're in a well ventilated area or wear a respirator uh, this stuff will start to flake on the floor and you know you notice people will put it on the floor pans inside the fenders wheel wells that sort of thing and we like to clean this stuff off but you're gonna need some gloves a respirator like I said and some of these good scrape blades putty blades whatever you call them to scratch off the old undercoating uh, the reason why we like to scrape it off is because you don't know what's lurking underneath there could be rot or rust there and cancer spots that you want to repair and then usually what we do is we scrape this stuff off and we'll usually media blast it, uh, the rest off to make it nice and smooth. And then uh, paint it, uh, the color of the car, or get some POR paint, rust preventative paint to stop it from rusting. So, got any questions? Chris at ClassicVWBugs.com or visit my website, www.ClassicVWBugs.com. Um.